Hello and welcome to PM Studio's Photoshop Tutorials. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys another text effect. Um, it's going to be very fast, it's very effective, very professional looking. Um, adds a little flavor to a professional looking website. Uh, I am estimate that this entire tutorial will probably take about three minutes and three and a half minutes, give or take about ten seconds. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is create a new document. So file new. You can create it whatever size you want. I'm going to make mine 1920 by 1280 like always. I'm going to push OK and it's going to give you this document. Now, um, we, for the sake of this one we're going to set our background color to black and then we're going to create a new layer and on top of that layer we're going to add text. Yeah. Alright, well we can make that te a text layer. We're going ahead and going to go ahead and put in whatever word we want. If you have a black background I suggest you use white text just so you can see what, we, what you're doing. So I'm going to type in desert this is going to be picture in text. So, after we've done that, we're going to go down here to the background and create a new layer again. And we're going to control O or go to file open and then go click on your image that you want to put in the pic and put in the text. Um, for the sake of this one, I have a picture of Monument Valley, Utah. So, I'm just going to select all and I'm going to copy it. You can cut it if you like as well, but I'm just going to copy it. Now we gotta set it so that it's the size of the document. So Control T to uh, change the image. And being that this is a uh, a Microsoft stock photo, it's really good at stretching and doesn't get really pixelated because Microsoft makes their images compatible with every um, every screen size. So apply that, and then we're going to Control click on the thumbnail of the text, which is going to select just the text itself. As you can see, um, the only selected areas are the text. And then we're going to select layer 1, or whatever your picture layer is, and then we're going to push Control c to copy, and then Control v to paste. As you can see, it created a new layer. If you've got a good monitor, you can probably see that it says desert on the thumbnail. So we're just going to get rid of the, uh, the text layer, and we're going to get rid of the picture layer, and there we go. We've got a picture of Monument Valley, Utah, inside the text desert. So, again, I said this was going to be very short. I hope you guys have enjoyed this tutorial, and I hope to see you guys next time. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and don't forget to visit us at simostudios.webs.com.